Hi there, my name is Andy. I'm part of the education team here at Sea City Museum. And uh, we're looking today at this collection of items. And the thing that connects them is that they were all found in a medieval cellar, but probably thrown away. And they date from the late 15th century, so that's sort of the beginning of the Tudor times. Henry VII is on, is on the throne. And this was a time in Southampton's history when it was really at the peak of its importance. Um, at that time, the wool industry and selling wool abroad was basically England's largest economy by some margin. And in exchange for, uh, for wool going abroad, merchants would bring in instead exotic goods from France, from Germany, from the Low Countries, from Spain, from Italy. And here we've got a, a number of them here. So we've got some lovely Murano glass. And if you know anything about glass, you know that's, that's the good stuff. So we've got some nice glass there. We've got from France, saint ware which are, the, the pattern is very distinctive. Um, it's finely glazed and very, very colourful. But it's all been thrown away, and, and some of them, you know, clearly have been broken, and that could be why. But, but archaeologists reckon that it's all been thrown away because where uh, the merchant was moving out, they didn't want to take all the stuff with them. They couldn't leave it on the, on the front because they'd get a fine, so they, they stuff it and they bury it in one of their cellars to be found hundreds of years later by archaeologists. And I just think they're just a wonderful example of what Southampton might have been like about 500 years ago.